Hello friends, welcome to my channel. Moving on with my project on building 6 degree of freedom robotic arm. Here you can see joint 6 in assembly with the grip arm. The type of gearboxes I use in the joints of the robot are not back drivable. As you can see I can't move the joint with my hand. As you know from my previous videos I use sort of force sensors made of velostat. This is force sensitive resistor. And now thanks to these sensors I can detect the load applied to the joint and make the joint follow this external force. I will need this feature later when teaching the robot to execute certain trajectories. Alright, let's move on to the next joint assembly.
Alright, this is the final result. As you can see, joint 5 is supposed to be activated by timing belt. I use timing belt here mostly because I wanted to make input shaft hollow to pass wires through it. And also, of course, for design reasons. Also here I have screws which, when rotated, move this carriage with the motor and the pulley downside and tension the belt in such a way. Alright, next we move on to the gearbox assembly. It will be analogous to the gearbox in the Joint 6, so it will be split ring planetary gearbox with gear reduction of around 30. Alright, that's it for today, thanks for watching and see you next time.